Welcome to Anatomy and Physiology Practice Questions for Chapters 3 and 4. There are 62 questions. Ready? What are joints that do not permit movement? A. Diarthroses. B. Synarthroses. C. Synovial. D. Ampharthroses. The answer is B. Synarthroses. What reduces friction during joint movement and absorbs shock? A. Synovial fluid. B. Versa. C. Connective tissue. D. Cartilage. The answer is A. Synovial fluid. What and what in the skin are an important part of the body's temperature regulating system? A. Vitamin D. Subcutaneous layer. B. Capillary networks. Sweat glands. C. Vitamin D. Sweat glands. D. Capillary networks. Subcutaneous layer. The answer is B. Capillary networks. Sweat glands. What excrete excess water and some wastes from the body? A. Sebaceous glands. B. Sweat glands. C. Hair follicles. D. Sensory receptors. The answer is B. Sweat glands. A what is an airspace lined with mucous membrane found in certain cranial bones? A. Meatus. B. Sinus. C. Foramen. D. Suture. The answer is B. Sinus. A shallow depression on the surface of a bone is called a what? A. Sulcus. B. Facet. C. Sinus. D. Fossa. The answer is D. Fossa. What is a tough waterproofing protein which fills most of each epidermal cell? A. Keratin. B. Melanin. C. Collagen. D. Keratine. The answer is A. Keratin. What is largely responsible for the mechanical strength of the skin? A. Vitamin D. B. Keratine. C. Collagen. D. Keratin. The answer is C. Collagen. What prevents the loss of fluid so the cells do not dry out? A. Pigment. B. Skin. C. Keratin. D. Melanin. The answer is B. Skin. What, also known as oil glands, are generally attached to hair follicles? A. Arcterpili. B. Papillae. C. Sweat glands. D. Sebaceous glands. The answer is D. Sebaceous glands. Identify the structure at the red arrow. A. Arcterpili. B. Papillae. C. Sweat glands. D. Sebaceous glands. The answer is C. Sweat glands. Identify the structure at the red arrow. A. Epidermis. B. Dermis. C. Subcutaneous. D. Subdermis. The answer is B. Dermis. As what of sweat occurs, the body becomes cooler? A. Production. B. Metabolism. C. Evaporation. D. Circulation. The answer is C. Evaporation. Beneath the skin is an underlying what layer that has adipose tissue? A. Epidermis. B. Endodermis. C. Subcutaneous. D. Dermis. The answer is C. Subcutaneous. Blood vessels and nerves are generally absent in the what layer but are found throughout the A. Epidermis, dermis. B. Dermis, subcutaneous layer. C. Dermis, epidermis. D. Epidermis, cartilage. The answer is A. Epidermis, dermis. Each what is a tiny coiled tube in the dermis or subcutaneous tissue, with a duct that extends up through the skin and opens onto the surface? A. Sweat gland. B. Sebaceous gland. C. Hair follicle. 
D. Hair shaft. The answer is A. Sweat gland. In what? An inherited condition that can occur in any person, the cells are not able to produce melanin. A. Glaucoma. B. Melanism. C. Melanoma. D. Albinism. The answer is D. Albinism. Located within the skin, what detect touch, pressure, heat, cold, and pain? A. Thermal sensors. B. Integumentary receptors. C. Sensory receptors. D. Epidermal sensors. The answer is C. Sensory receptors. Melanin is A. Also known as keratin. B. Associated with keratin in the stratum corneum. C. A pigment that gives color to hair and skin. D. Overproduced in the condition known as albinism. The answer is C. A pigment that gives color to hair and skin. Nails appear pink because A. They contain melanin. B. Of their keratine content. C. Of underlying capillaries. D. They are made of keratin. The answer is C. Of underlying capillaries. Nails consist mainly of what? A. Connective tissue. B. Compressed keratin. C. Collagen. D. Sebum. The answer is B. Compressed keratin. New epidermal cells are constantly produced in the deepest sublayer of the what? A. Endodermis. B. Epidermis. C. Dermis. D. Subcutaneous layer. The answer is B. Epidermis. New epidermal cells are pushed to the outer sublayer of skin called the what? A. Dermal papillae. B. Stratum corneum. C. Superficial fascia. D. Stratum basal. The answer is B. Stratum corneum. Sebaceous glands secrete an oily substance called what that oils the hair, lubricates the surface of the skin, and helps prevent water loss. A. Melanin. B. Vitamin D. C. Keratin. D. Sebum. The answer is D. Sebum. Identify the structure at the red arrow A. Carpal. B. Occipital. C. Frontal. D. Femur. The answer is C. Frontal bone. Identify the structure at the red arrow A. Calcaneus. B. Occipital. C. Humerus. D. Femur. The answer is D. Femur. Identify the structure at the red arrow A. Patella. B. Temporal. C. Humerus. D. Femur. The answer is C. Humerus. Identify the structure at the red arrow, A. Patella. B. Scapula. C. Clavicle. D. Sternum. The answer is, C. Clavicle. Blood vessels that nourish the bone tissue? A. Lend the haversion canals. B. Pass through the haversion canals. C. Connect the fibrocytes. D. Extend through narrow channels. The answer is, A. Line the haversion canals. Bones are held together at joints by bands of connective tissue called what? A. Tendons. B. Ligaments. C. Fasciae. D. Marrow. The answer is, B. Ligaments. Bones serve as levers that transmit what forces? A. Muscular. B. Skeletal. C. Neural. D. Neuromuscular. The answer is A. Muscular. Carpal bones are located where? Proximal to the what? A. Dot in the wrist, fingers. B. Dot in the ankle, toes. C. Dot in the ankle, heel. D. Dot at the junction of the wrist and palm, fingers. The answer is A. In the wrist, fingers. 
Compact bone consists of interlocking, spindle-shaped units called what? A. Osteans. B. Lacunae. C. Osteoblasts. D. Articular cartilage. The answer is, A. Osteans. Compact bone, which is very dense and hard, is found in what, where great strength is needed. A. In the ribs only. B. Within the epiphyses. C. In small cavities called lacunae. D. Near the surface of the bone. The answer is, D. Near the surface of the bone. Each half of the pectoral girdle consists of a what and a what? A. Rib, sternum. B. Sternum, clavicle. C. Sternum, vertebra. D. Scapula, clavicle. The answer is, D. Scapula, clavicle. If we compare the upper and lower limbs, A. The 16 carpal bones correspond to the 16 tarsal bones. B. The 15 metacarpal bones correspond to the 15 metatarsal bones. C. Each has 28 phalanges. D. The humerus corresponds to the tibia. The answer is, C. Each has 28 phalanges. Muscles are attached to bones by bands of connective tissue called what? A. Marrow. B. Ligaments. C. Tendons. D. Fasciae. The answer is, C. Tendons. Osteoblasts. A. Produce appetite. B. Are cells that break down bone. C. Form osteoclasts. D. Produce bone by secreting collagen. The answer is, D. Produce bone by secreting collagen. Osteoclasts are cells that A. Produce bone. B. Secrete the protein collagen. C. Are modeled during growth. D. Break down bone. The answer is, D. Break down bone. Osteocytes are found in small cavities called what? A. Lacunae. B. Haversian canals. C. Marrow. D. Osteoclasts. The answer is, A. Lacunae. Synovial fluid is secreted by a membrane lining the what? A. Tendons. B. Marrow. C. Ligaments. D. Joint capsule. The answer is, D. Joint capsule. The what are growth centers that disappear at maturity, becoming vague epiphyseal lines? A. Epiphyses. B. Ligaments. C. Diaphyses. D. Metaphyses. The answer is, D. Metaphyses. The what capsule is made of tough, fibrous connective tissue and surrounds the joint? A. Joint. B. Ligament. C. Ball and socket. D. Bursa. The answer is, A. Joint capsule. The what is not part of the appendicular skeleton? A. Scapula. B. Pelvic girdle. C. Sacrum. D. Bones of the upper extremities. The answer is, C. Sacrum. The sacrum is part of the axial. What is not part of the axial skeleton? A. Pelvic girdle. B. Sternum. C. Skull. D. Ribs. The answer is, A. Pelvic girdle. C. Red color. What system supports and protects the body by serving as a bony framework for the other tissues and organs? A. Nervous. B. Integumentary. C. Skeletal. D. Muscular. The answer is, C. Skeletal. The cranium consists of how many cranial bones that enclose the brain? A. 22. B. 8. Circa 6. D. 20. The answer is, 8. The elbow and knee are examples of what type of joint? A. Hinge. B. Gliding. C. Saddle. D. Pivot. The answer is, A. Hinge joint. The expanded ends of the bone are called what? A. Metaphyses. 
B. Endosteum. C. Diaphysis. D. Epiphysis. The answer is D. Epiphysis. Epiphysis, the expanded end of the long bones in animals, which ossifies separately from the bone shaft but becomes fixed to the shaft when full growth is attained. The epiphysis is made of spongy cancellous bone covered by a thin layer of compact bone. The facial portion of the skull is made up of how many bones? A. 8. B. 20. Circa 34. D. 14. The answer is, 14. The forehead is formed by the what bone? A. Parietal. B. Sphenoid. C. Ethmoid. D. Frontal. The answer is, D. Frontal bone. The inner layer of the periosteum contains cells that produce what? A. Osteoclasts. B. Bone. C. Periosteum. D. Marrow. The answer is, B. Bone. The main shaft of a long bone is known as its what? A. Cartilage. B. Epiphysis. C. Metaphysis. D. Diophysis. The answer is, D. Diophysis. The marrow cavity of a long bone is lined with a thin layer of cells called the what? A. Osteum. B. Periosteum. C. Endosteum. D. Hylan. The answer is, C. Endosteum. The maxillae fuse to what? A. Form the lower jaw. B. Contain the olfactory nerves. C. Form the upper jaw. D. Hold the pituitary gland. The answer is, C. Form the upper jaw. The medial bone of the forearm, the main forearm bone in the elbow joint, is the A. Radius B. Femur C. Ulna D. Humerus The answer is, C. Ulna The neural arch, A, is protected by an intervertebral disc. B. Contains the spinal cord. C. Is the posterior, curved region of a vertebra. D. Is the body of a vertebra. The answer is, C. Is the posterior, curved region of a vertebra. The vertebral arch, or neural arch, is the posterior part of a vertebra. It consists of a pair of pedicles and a pair of laminae, and supports seven processes, four articular processes, two transverse processes. The occipital bone? A. Forms the posterior part and most of the floor of the skull. B. Is the lower jaw bone. C. Forms the forehead. D. Forms the roof of the cranium. The answer is, A. Forms the posterior part and most of the floor of the skull. The red marrow within some bones produces what? A. Blood cells. B. Osteocytes. C. Osteoclasts. D. Hormones. The answer is, A. Blood cells. The sagittal suture. A. Joins the parietal bones to the frontal bone. B. Is the joint between the two parietal bones. C. Joins the parietal bone to the occipital bone. D. Permits a baby's head to be compressed during birth. The answer is, B. Is the joint between the two parietal bones. The six types of what joints are gliding, condyloid, saddle, pivot, hinge, and ball and socket? A. Synarthrotic. B. Amphirothrotic. C. Synovial. D. Immovable. The answer is, C. Synovial. The spaces within the spongy bone are filled with what? A. Canaliculi. B. Lacunae. C. Osteans. D. Bone marrow. The answer is, D. Bone marrow. Keep watching this video over and over again. You will do well on the quizzes. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe, comment, like, and share.